Hello. Hello. You know what we haven't done? And oh my god, that's why the music's still playing. Like I was saying, you know what we haven't done in a while? Uh. Never really introduced who we were very much. Hmm. So, my, my, my name's Anthony. I'm the A in A and R walkthroughs. I'm Ricky, I guess. I'm the R. Haha, <laughs> R. He's the big R. At least my trucks aren't, my vehicles aren't gonna kill me. Uh, that's not true. Hmm. I've been in your truck, it probably will kill you. Mine's mechanically and suspensionally solid. Yours is. Look, what driving's the fuck? no fun without not. Driving, driving's no fun without bad suspension. Let's be real here. Okay, you're past the point of bad suspension. It's fucked. I've never had that many problems with it, though. Other than your fucking springs completely fucking broken. Yeah. But I mean, while driving, I never had a problem. It's on your left. You say it's bouncy, but I've been in bounce here. Like the Ranger. The Ranger wasn't bouncy, it was fucked. It had no frame and your seat wasn't bolted down, so... Thank you. Yours actually can be fixed. So it's not fucked. It's not. It, it's fucked, but it can be fixed. You can on fuck it. I wanna. I like how they're just standing here for no fucking reason. Hey, here, come on. That sounds like the Invisible Close. Man music. I guess. What? You said come here, what the fuck do you want? Alright, cause... I don't know. I'm running off this way. Wait a minute, this is where we were. Okay, so we're going this way. Yeah, directions in this game are kind of difficult. Walk towards big ass building and turn at big ass building. Yeah. Walk till you see another big ass building. If you see another big ass building, you went too far. <laughs> I know one thing though. I'm confusing the hell out of the AI in this game. Yeah. Alright, I think we're going this way. Okay, go up the hill, turn left at the dead raccoon. Okay. Walk about three feet to the other dead possum. Actually, I think it's like. I've hit one roadkill with my car, and I'm 90% sure it was a possum. Hmm. But I didn't really get a good look at it, other than it was big and white. Could have been my co-worker, for all I know. Big and white. That, that what? describes most what things. You... Oh, we're close. You've said that six times. We're close. The fuck do you mean we're close? Bitch, we're, we're driving from Chicago to fucking Los Angeles. And we're in St. Louis. We ain't anywhere close. Okay. Apparently, I gotta scan something. Can I get the dildo headstone? Oh shit, there it is! I think I found out what I was looking for. Oh yeah! Oh 
Oh, yeah, he's the fucking Kool-Aid man. I've always wanted to do that, by the way. Can I say, I just always wanted to do that. I guess you can say that. Won't y'all jump through someone's wall, dressed as a Kool-Aid man. So is the Kool-Aid man the glass or the liquid inside? Above you. The, the glass. Alright, as long as we're on the same page. Jump out of the way. Oh, fuck. Magic Michelle! Magic Michelle! I don't give a shit. Magic Michelle. Please tell me at the end of the game our character quits. I don't think so. Cause that would just make it all worth it. What it? Yes. You're like, yeah, you're you're one of us now, and he's just like, fuck you. So close to making that laser come out of this PP. You, you notice it too, don't lie. The mini proton pack. The pecker. The mini prostate exam. You hope. You don't want no giant fingered doctor up there. Can I go down? Man down, man down. <laughs> oh shit, hit the wrong button. Hold on. Okay, I'm about to die. Thank you. They felt that one in Pittsburgh. No, they felt that one in Gettysburg. They felt that one in Gary, Indiana. What the fuck's with Gary, Indiana all of a sudden? I don't know, I was watching a video on it. It's interesting. It's apparently one of the most crime-ridden spots in the world right now. Michael Jackson was born there. Hmm. Yeah. Almost forgot I didn't care. The, it's pretty much the new Detroit. No, Detroit is always going to be Detroit. Chicago is always going to be Chicago. I, I don't know. I've heard stories of people that are from Chicago and Detroit not fucking with Gary, Indiana. Apparently the police there just allow you to go through stop signs because if you stop your car for too long, you will get shot. Yeah. You didn't know that? What the fuck? Get out of the tree. Yeah, my dad, like, he's been there, so... I wanted to know what it's like. Is it fun? Is it like this? Well, when you get... Have a cop pull up to you when you're at a red light and they said don't stop for anything. Yeah. You get, like, okay, I'm not coming here again. Hey, hey, don't stop. Keep going. Do you want me to do something? What the fuck do you want me to do? Why are you looking at me? Do I turn you on? Hey, wanna fuck? Are you gonna open the door? Or am I going to? What's happening? Open the... the game freeze. Oh, is this thing, I think. There we go. Yeah, that's good. Thanks. 
Yeah, desecrate dead bodies. Who? Maybe we could have went over the fence, but you know. Scratching myself. It's a whole bunch of them. Wait a minute. Gotta move. Oh, I thought you were a ghost. Run! On the right! Look behind you. Whoa! Look at them all! Ooh, that's smart! First the only reason Ray's here is because we didn't hang out with them during the sewers, because he was driving the boat. I would have took that job and the just boat. sat there and drive the boat. <laughs> Shandor. Well, at least the skull. Run! Clear out those roots. We've tried everything. This metal is psychonically charged, rendering it effectively indestructible. Uh -huh. Well, in such an extreme situation, I suppose it's possible to cause it harm, but I don't think anything we have is going to make a dent in it. Then what's our plan? Ray, you two check out that side. I think I'm picking up something odd here. What's your take on this? An indestructible gate attached to a damaged frame. A few concussive hits and the hinges might just break loose. Stone Angels, ignore their PP, because they might have one. Come 
Come on. Oh shit, what the fuck happened to that thing? These things are fucking annoying. Mm-hmm. Little cherry shrimp. Little cherry shrimp. Going around eating fish shit. Bladder. Hmm. We've tried everything. This metal is psychonically charged, rendering it effectively indestructible. Uh, well, in such an extreme situation, I suppose it's possible to cause it harm, but I don't think anything we have is going to make a dent in it. Then what's our plan? Ray, you should check out that side. I think I'm picking up something odd here. What's your take on this? An indestructible gate attached to a damaged frame. Concussive hits and the hinges might just break loose. Uh, 12 o'clock high. They're too well protected. Our energy streams aren't going to hurt them. Peter, go kick one. The only hope we have is to stay alive and keep them away from the echo. I wholeheartedly agree with Rick. More precisely, they're little stone angels capable of attaining speeds of 198 feet per second before they hit their targets, which is us. I'm a cozy angel. Man, I'm going back to Sunday soon. The particle throwers aren't doing anything to them. Tether them and smash them into something. You know what? I think this is a missed opportunity. Yeah? They could add actual kamikaze plasma on this part. How much ectoplasm can one ghost produce? To the right! This is a good place for slime tethering. Now how cool that would be. I'm sorry, what was any of that you just said? I think this is a missed opportunity. About kamikaze pilots that you're trying to say? Yes. Okay. Can you imagine that? Corona! Hook them together. I mean, this is way before Corona existed. Uh, you get what I mean now. You get how I would think that was funny. Sure. Oh my god, just come on, tether! I'm fucking hitting the goddamn button! Oh my god. We're gonna be here a while, folks. Mm -hmm. Go down. I like this timing, but it's a little bit scary. Hmm. Hook together. Come on. Oh my god. So I get one down and then I fall. Oh, 
Oh my god. Go breaking the tether. There we go. Thanks for joining the party. All right, do it. I think we're getting close. Hey, guy, a little help? I bet we could pull these gates. Hey, Rick, we got a chain or wit for this thing? I didn't plan for a fun-filled day of off-roading with Ecto One, so no. The tether might prove useful here. Okay, kid. tether the gate to my bumper, and I'll pull it down. Okay, good. Give me a few more, just to be sure. Now we're talking. This way, gentlemen. Thank you. That's why I didn't get hit by a door. Hmm. But that'll be the end for today's episode. Mm -hmm. Bye.